Cool. Follow me. I want to light this on fire. Alright, fine, I won't. Let's see if there's shit here. Damn it, I wanted to loot the room! Dicks! He is not alone. He's not the last. I understand his excitement and his wish to immediately meet the others. To free them and wake them up. But he has agreed to wait a bit longer. First, he's going to try and help us. If we make it to the conference, the Dark One will be able to open up the thoughts of Moskvin, or Corbut himself. Perhaps make them stop this madness. This is our last chance. Okay, sure. Uh, I was gonna say, what was it? Uh, oh yes, three things on my list. Number one, how the hell is this quick to go all the way the fuck around the polis? Look how close I've been on it like multiple times. It's kinda bullshit. Anyways, uh, what else was I going to say? Uh... Yes, like I said, I'll help- if the kid feels the need to kill everyone, I understand. I'll give him my gun, my assault rifle, directly. We already knew about Thomas from Khan. He confront Moskvin on this, yet he didn't even try to disprove it. He told that by sheer luck, the Kennedy Defense Squad was exercising nearby. And thus, despite some sacrifice, they were able to lift this starting epidemic in its blood. Otherwise, it would have engulfed the whole of Mentor. What can you say to that? Even I would have done the same. But Colonel, it was Lasnitsky, the agent who stole a virus container from D6 right before the outbreak. So, uh -huh. there is not a single living witness besides Arthur. Who'd believe the order? Look at him, he's got like a little cloak thingy. What if it was us who released the virus? Ah. The Reds tried to break through into Hans' territory. Yeah. We could make Moskvin. What can we do? We are not an army. We've less than a hundred fighters. Yes, Moskvin did gear up for war. But after Polis suggested that we share the wealth inside Don't worry, kid. It's okay, it's okay. We agreed to peace. We must do everything to have that agreement signed. Moskvin, what difference has he made? He's just a puppet in Corbett's hands. And while he's talking, Corbett's forces are okay, you. you. You'll seal this peace agreement with your blood. What? You've got a better idea? You brought this ape here. Open what now? Yes, We're done with this. Let's go to the council hall. Follow me. Sweet. I can't just walk through the door. Permission to report, Colonel. Denied. Urgent dispatch to D6 Security Force Commander. Go to highest alert. Instruct Korneyev to proceed with... Okay. Hello, any loot in here? I need some loot. I can speak in bullets. It's not really, I have plenty of bullets. Oh, hey, thing! Uh, fucking four pages?! Four full fucking page. Okay, fine. All right. <clears throat> oh, oh, wait. I missed a wait. I missed a note in the dead city. Shit. Missed a note in the dead city. Damn it. That's like the only note I've missed in the entire game. Oh wait, nope, nope. Missed the one in Regine. Regine and note four of revolution. And torchlight. I missed. Five or six notes. Good to know. That's quite unfortunate. Where was I? Hey, yes. Let's let's pull the notes back up. How do I get that diary? Yes. Uh, I asked the kid about how he made it. How did he survive the inferno? How I knew when the missiles rained upon the city, the dark ones. He was simply not there. The the dark ones. We've been asked ourselves how it happened so that the new state uh, sentient life emerged almost instantly. Why did we take millions of years of evolution? All the Dark Ones needed was a few years. The answer was simple. It was us, people who had brought them to life. They emerged among uh, amongst us. Shukhol was my uh, Shukhol was my stepfather uh, was right. Shukhol, my stepfather was right. Uh, they were the next stage of evolution. Not next to ours. We were their fathers, and they were our children. We had created so many weapons to destroy ourselves with, and one of them weapon one of those weapons gave birth to them. They are not like us. Uh, what kills us may uh, makes them stronger. We left them a ravaged, poisoned world, but they learned to live in it. 
They sustain themselves by absorbing radiation. After being born, they do not uh, enter the world at once. For some time, they continue to exist in a dream, gro uh, growing and learning from the ones who came to be before them. What we destroyed was their home, but the place where their young ones slept was underground, close to the botanical gardens, close to the TV tower. It was in the bunkers under the TV uh, building, which were connected to D6. But when the warheads fell, the entrance tunnels uh, caved in. The dark ones who were almost ready to enter the world got blocked inside. Instead, uh, instead of them, he, the little one, opened his eyes, awakened by the explosion and the last screams of his mother. Knowing nothing of what had happened, not ready for anything, knowing nothing of the world, he tried looking for his kin, but could not find them, because the few survivors continued sleeping. Their time to wake up had come and passed, for very soon they could die of hunger without even opening their eyes once. I don't know how Khan pressured Miller, but he was the icon of stoicism and did not reach for his weapon when he saw the Dark One. And the following event shocked me even more than the planes of the Reds. Uh, plans of the Reds. There were Dark Ones in D6. Khan had hypnotized uh, hip hypothesized that there were they were created artificially before the war, created as what? Soldiers immune duration, radiation, and having no need for voice communication? Could be, but then God probably decided to breathe souls into them. Ow, my jaw hurts. Oh, no, I'm fine with you. Though I am thirsty. So I'm gonna get a drink of my water. Hey, can I loot this stuff? Eh, nope, I can't. I can't get through this hole. So, Spartan Spartans. Hello. The Reich's right here. The, uh, who are these guys? These guys are the Reds? I think these guys are the Reds. The Reich, the Reds, I think. There's more Reich. This is the one guy, is the Polis people, I think, or something, I'm not sure. What is their symbol, anyways? It's not the Nazi symbol, that's kind of interesting. More of the Reich. Oh, guys, the Reds? I don't know. Stay close to the little one. Let there be peace! In the name of our children! You are a liar! Come, are you out of your mind? I know what I'm doing. Just believe me. Just this one time. Who are okay. You? Guards, take this man away. Ranger, stand up! Argue. Little one, it's your turn. Okay. Hello. Come on up, little kid. Why can't I move any closer? Okay. What's going on? Are we doing another drug trip again? I'm getting tired of drug trips. What? It's like... Stalin Paradise. We're going this way. Comrade Moscovin, you must support me on this, or else some inconvenient details might surface concerning your brother's death. Okay. What's this one? I overheard one conversation between your brother and his advisor about the threat you pose and ways to eliminate it. Okay. What's the hell? Threat? We're brothers. He thinks you feel bypassed, cheated. He fears you will overthrow him. <laughs> He's totally mad. Totally. I'm going to give him an earful. Words alone will not avert his assassination plans. No, you must strike first. So this is the shit that happened. So I don't really think it matters. Brother. 
I'm so pleased that we finally made up. It was a fight over nothing. Let's have a drink. Sure, brother. Where? Well, shit. What? Maxim Leonidovich Moskvin has been elected. I wonder if you can walk this way. Congratulations, Commander. So he's got like a bunch of pictures of like marks and all that jazz on him, Stalin. Silent treatment. What are you looking at me with those honest eyes for? Not so happy, are you? Yeah, it's quite unfortunate. It was your fault. Who wanted me dead? Corbett sold you out. And now, he's got me by the balls. All because of you. Yep. You're an idiot, because he tricked your ass. Stupid fool. That's why you don't kill your sorry. siblings. Even I'm if so it, sorry, even you know they're going to kill you, just let it go. There's no forgiveness for me. Even so. My God, seriously, drug trivia. 